on, on the tools front, there, there's kind of three buckets of tools that I think people should start investing in. One, one is just kind of better tools around detecting, kind of understanding when something has gone wrong. I mean, one of the scary things we see in the news all the time is like, oh man, this hack happened and we're finding out about it six months later or a year later. And so being able to kind of have better kind of monitoring and scanning kind of understanding like, hey, what um, what's actually happening in our system, I think is, is something people are investing a lot in. And I think it's starting to normalize using those tools. And again, not making a scary thing, right? Like shifting that culture a little bit. It's like right now, when you see something wrong, it's kind of like, oh man, if I report this, it's like something really bad. Lowering that kind of barrier to be like, oh, it's really normal that like we're constantly monitoring, we're constantly alerting on these things. Um, and also being smart, you know, I think the, the flip side of that problem is, is a lot of companies experience alert fatigue. And so you, what you see is a lot of companies now, companies that do 